Chill for real, bro. I'm willing to bet your name, C paid influencer. You know, I used to fuck with you and the whole save Billy bullshit. But, you know, once you start talking shit about other people in the community for exposing the full extent of this fraud which permeates into our own goddamn board, then I got a problem because you're fucking with my money now. If you like losing money, that's that's on you, dog. You wife beating little bitch. But me, I like making money. And I like exposing fraud. I want free and fair markets. So don't talk shit about people exposing that. All you gotta do is go to Council on Foreign Relations website, go to the roster, and see how this invite-only invite only private think tank comprised of the highest bankers in the world how our CEO is a is a member of as well as our lead director Philip Ladder who we never hear about just this shadow figure fucking total globalist there's some proof at a Maximilian bitch ass Aaron and we go to L for Ladder now, Philip Ladder, which is a former UK ambassador to the Clintons, is a current senior advisor of Morgan Stanley, which is the highest dark pool operator today. Get that through your skull, bro. You want to ban dark pools and payment for order flow? Well, Morgan Stanley is a conflict of interest sitting on our own damn board. All right? Now, let's go back to members and go under corporate membership. Let's see who's calling the shots. And when we go under roster, we see the founders are comprised of Citibank, which the, the documents were leaked of Project Popcorn, partnered with Morgan Stanley, and Goldman Nutsacks, just constantly spoofing our stock every other day, and BlackRock, the fucking tip of the iceberg, which Philip Ladder's daughter happened to leave a management position of BlackRock to fucking co-found Uniswap, which was implicated in the FTX fiasco, when eight quadrillion AMC shares were caught swapping around to alleviate those failure to delivers, they were used on Uniswap to swap them. And guess who else worked at FTX? Adam Aaron's son, Jeremy Aaron. Too many coincidences, dog. You know what I mean? In all the freaking research I've done on reverse splits and conversions on preferred equities, not good. Because I looked into it. I give a shit about my money, unlike you. So I don't know what the deal is with you, bro. But uh, I'll get it together and join the right side. I swear to God, Adam Aaron does not represent our best interest.